Batman vs Superman Dawn of Justice takes us back to the devastating struggle between Superman and General Zod at the end of 2013's Man of Steel. Only this time we see it from the perspective of one Bruce Wayne, aka the Batman, who's none too happy to see buildings crushed to dust and innocent citizens terrified by superpowered negligence. At this point, the caped crusader is 20 years into a fight against crime in Gotham that's left him angry and frustrated, and he's not hesitant to level his rage at any target. He has the power to wipe out the entire human race. If we believe there's even a 1% chance that he is our enemy, we have to take it as an absolute certainty. Batman isn't afraid to face off with any foe who's hurting the innocent, even if that foe wears a red and yellow S on his chest. Maybe it's the Gotham City in me. We just have a bad history with freaks dressed like clowns. This superhero movie certainly depicts good guys who are more than willing to give their all for others. But director Zack Snyder's version of this DC comic book universe is a bit edgier than we've known it to be before. A weary Batman physically brands baddies, and Clark Kent is actually living with his love, Lois Lane. Add in dark spiritual undertones, lots of slamming violence, some unexpected sensuality and profanity, and you've got a film that might just be kryptonite for your young hero-loving kids. So I'm giving Batman vs Superman two and a half batarangs out of five for family friendliness. For our full review, visit PluggedIn.com. Plugging you into the movies, I'm Cheryl Wilhelmy for Focus on the Family's Plugged In Movie Review.